through to Tower Table, go and Price. You're through to the quarterfinals. How are you feeling? I'm feeling all right that I won, but disappointed the way I won. It was probably one of the worst games I've played all year, but you know, it seems to be going from one extreme to the next. I can't seem to find form and be consistent, but like I said, I'm through and I won. I went in the first break 3 2 down, thought I should have been 4 1 up. Second break 5 all, probably should have been 8 2 up. And that's where, that's where my game was going down. I'm just thinking about legs, previous legs, and then struggling struggling to build from that. And it just gets a little bit frustrating. But, you know, like I said, the next five legs, I didn't play too well. But I thought, I find a little bit of form when you got this game in the bag easy. But Josh probably you know, probably played his worst game of the year as well. But I'd rather lose playing ugly. And, I'd rather win playing ugly and lose playing really well. So I'm through. And it's your first quarter final in all Bounds as well, so yeah, so it's a new venue, and I, I don't know. It just seems seems to be all right for me. It seems to be bringing me a little bit of luck. Don't know if it's the venue or the new ring. I'm not sure. Uh, and I think you showed no fear today. I mean, you were. Obviously, you do show aggression in games, but you really got out of the box. When you got that first break, it really seemed to, like Josh really struggled maybe a little bit. Yeah, it's like the game is so frustrating. You're trying so hard sometimes to get that break and get maybe a two or three leg gap. And that's what I was trying too hard, I think. Whereas three days ago, I'm playing Simon, I need to get the two legs, no pressure on me, and, and the darts are flowing. But I just. Five all. I was probably the most frustrated person I've ever been. Like, but like I said, I broke him. I was six five up. Then I broke him seven five. I just knew he wasn't going to break me back. I, I wasn't playing well, but neither was he. And like I said, I'm, I'm not. I'm not happy with the win. I'm happy that I'm into the quarterfinals and hopefully you know, over the next two days I'll I'll rest a little bit of practice and come back stronger Friday. And after obviously you had a very tough group this year at the Grand Slam. Do you think maybe? After that, there was a bit of fatigue. Obviously, it's a very no, not at all. I, you know, I turn up to every game. It doesn't matter who I play. It just it's all about me now. I think. And whereas two, maybe a year, twelve months, eighteen months ago, I'm thinking about the other player. I just think about myself. I was confident I was going to win this group anyway. Now I've beaten Simon probably seven out of ten times. I never played Glenn, but I've, I've met him. I know he's a good player, but I was confident I could beat him as well. But. Well, it was it was a difficult group, but I was confident I could come through. It had nothing to do with fatigue; it's just just the way I think sometimes. Mm. Obviously, you're, you're very confident going into the quarterfinal. How far do you think you can go this Well, I'm here to win it. I'm not here to make up the numbers. Whoever wins out of Peter and and I think it's Simon. Like I said, I'm confident against Simon. Peter isn't playing his best at the moment. I think I can get I can get the final if and whatever happens after that. I suppose. Just go ahead.